Center here in Home Depot, getting ready to get the paint for the fireplace primer and all of that great stuff. So, I think we're over here on this side. We gotta get, oh, I got the list on my phone. What we are going to be needing. Oh, I'm sorry, babe, I didn't know you were still right there. What we're going to be needing. So, let me pull out my phone. I know we're gonna be needing um, a particular type of brush. Oh. <laughs> okay. So we need to find a larger nap for the. Do you love me? Do you wanna be my friend? If you do, well then don't be afraid to take me by the hand. If you want to, I think this is how love goes. Check yes or no. I think this is. What is the largest nap you have? Is it the three quarter? Mm, yes. Okay. All right. Thank you. That's exactly what I wanted you mean to know. The thickest or the yeah, longest? the thickest. I'm sorry. The thickest. Yeah, yeah. It's this three quarter. Okay. You gonna need another one for anything else? Well, we will for the walls, but not this thick because this one is gonna be strictly for the brick. Okay. Gotcha. I thought she said they didn't have no other texture when then but that one baby look at that one right there not that one we saw that one that's the one i was looking for hmm. she said they didn't have no other ones but that is the one that's the one i wanted what is that oh yeah okay. yeah so you want to get one of these yeah because i'm going to use that to do the uh the uh texture after you lay that let me see this one Oh, it's hard too. Which one do you think would be better? I think it would be. What you think? I like this one. You get this one. It'd be too big for it. Huh? It's just gonna. See, the whole purpose is to just. Sorry. Looking at rollers. So, texture, paint, and coatings. So the whole purpose is to lightly touch the brick with that with that lighter color of the gray. So what's the design you think? See this might not do good on that brick because of how hard it is. Okay. So see. this this probably would be this better one is because softer. Okay. Since you're gonna touch it kind of lightly, lightly, yeah, you ain't gonna go with that because you're just gonna be touching it. Yeah. Hopefully this will be the trick. We'll know when we get there. Yeah. If you want to, right. this is kind of love. That's it. Check yes or no. Okay. So you gonna need. One for the bedroom as well? Well, no, we can reuse oh, this. So, do you think we need to get one of these for the bedroom? Mm -hmm. Cause you're gonna be doing the bedroom too, right? Yeah. How much is that? I want. We don't have a price on wall on this. We don't have a price on no. Okay, so this is the tray. We gotta get a tray. Gotta get a liner for the tray, right? Yeah, yeah. I need to get two of those, huh? Let's see. One. Yeah, I got liner and pan. Okay. So we got liners and pans, and now I got that, and now I need to get the brush for the. Um, a brush for the uh, for the grout area. Let me check my list while I'm at it. 
$1.53. That's in my price range, $1.53. Let me turn this around. All right, so that's a dollar fifty-three. That's the one that I need right here. I don't know. Maybe I need a bigger one. It's a three-inch. And maybe I'll look at the four-inch as well. Can't hurt, huh? Okay. There's solvents, adhesives, and glues, but for what I'm using it for, this will be perfect. Yeah, I'm going with these. If it don't work, I'm, I don't know. Okay. Find my hoodie. There he is. <laughs> All right, so we've picked out the colors for our fireplace, and these are the colors we're going with. We're going to roll this on first, the darker one. And then we're gonna go over it with a lighter color, just as like a little accent, but not a whole lot, but just to brighten it up a little bit. So these are our two colors. And also these are gonna be the two colors that we use for the outside of our house too. We're gonna match it on up. Match it up, bring in the outside in. Y'all stay tuned. That's our paint being mixed for the fireplace. I am so excited. Love those little paint tools right there that they gave us to open our bucket. It's coloring, but we can we we can't make it waterproof. We can't. I don't know. I have to talk to them and see. So we we just keep the samples. Keep the samples, yeah. So we're choosing flooring, y'all. We're trying to decide if we're gonna get the uh, what we're what we're gonna get with the we're going with the luxury vinyl tile on the floor, and I think we've chosen options. We're either gonna go with the uh, lighthouse oak here in the middle for the floors I like that or we're gonna go with the Canadian hewn oak up top up there because I like that color too yeah we like both of those colors I think the difference is is that one is thicker than the other this is thinner but these over here are waterproof also which is what we really want that's what we really want so in any case I'm really liking that lighthouse oak right there in the middle yeah I'm really liking that all right so this is uh, the stove that I'm going with right here I like it I like it Yeah, this is the stove that I'm going with right here. 538s. It's a nice stove, uh-huh. Yep, it's a very nice stove. I can do a lot of cooking, a lot of baking. And a lot of canning on top of this big boy. And it's got the warmer in the middle and the grill. That's exactly what I wanted. A stove with the grill in the center. So I like it. I'm going with it. This is the refrigerator. 20.4 cubic feet for 678. It looks good. I like it. The freezer, you open that bottom door, babe. Yep, big enough for what I want and for what I need to look after me and my husband and our family, our grandbabies and children. It's perfect. Plus we got the other refrigerator at home so we don't need a whole big giant refrigerator. We got two. So we are leaving. 
More power, more doing. That's the Home Depot. <laughs> We're leaving Home Depot with our paint supplies and we picked up a few things that we need um, to get started on our chicken coop. So, um, we're gonna get back now and get going on this fireplace. We got some work to do out there, right babe? And in the rest of that chicken coop because I think we're down here, honey. And we got more stuff to do on that chicken coop, so we're gonna get to that chicken coop. Uh -huh. Way to go. <laughs> Stuff adds up to y'all. But these are supplies. These are supplies that we need. So we gotta do what we gotta do. Hey babe. Yeah. Where's our truck? Oh there it is. So yeah. Alright y'all. Y'all stay tuned. Stay tuned.